Hello guys, how are you doing today? Hope you're doing well. Let's talk about idioms. Idioms are phrases which people use in everyday language, which do not make sense literally, but we understand what they mean. An idiom is an expression that has a meaning apart from the meanings of its individual's words. So for example, it's raining cats and dogs. The literal meaning suggests that cats and dogs are falling from the sky. This is the wrong meaning. But actually, the real meaning we interpret it to mean that it is actually raining hard. So when we say it's raining cats and dogs, we mean that it's raining hard. There's no cat or there's no dog getting down from the sky, okay? Other examples. To stick your neck out is to say or do something that is bold and a bit dangerous. Similar idiom that is used for slightly more dangerous situations is to go out on a limb. In post idioms, the idea is that you put yourself in a vulnerable position. To break the ice is to be the first one to say or do something with the expectation that others will then follow. Also, another meaning for it, if you were uh, the first time to meet someone, so actually you're breaking the ice, to telling him your name, your friend, uh, how are you, how are you doing, some information about yourself, so you're breaking the ice that, you know, prevents you from being a sociable person. Another idiom that means something is similar to get the ball rolling, start your business. To get long in the tooth means to get old. The expression was originally used when referring to horses. Since gums recede with age, so the longer the teeth a horse has, the older it is said to be. To have a chip on one's shoulder is usually an expression to describe a person who acts as you say, rudely or aggressively, but also in a manner that could be described as aggressively defensive. The person seems always ready for a fight. Food for thought. These idioms are all about food. Can you explain what they really mean? If you know, please put the answers below. Taking two bits of the cherry, sitting like hot cakes, playing the gooseberry, going bananas, Feel like a fish out of the water, or be like a fish out of the water, meaning feel uncomfortable because you are in an unfamiliar situation. If you feel like a fish out of the water, you feel awkward or uncomfortable. You're not okay because you are in an unusual or unfamiliar situation. Maybe you travel to United States for the first time of your of your life so you are a fish out of the water because in your country the customs and traditions were not the same more examples i don't like going to the big parties they have i always feel like a fish out of the water there todd is a country boy raised in a small town in northumberland and was like a fish out of water when he visited bustling london some questions to be answered what does this really mean shake a leg hang on Turn someone off. Animal crackers. It's raining. A uh, and dogs. Complete. Complete the spaces. I've got a uh, space in my throat. Those are just space tears. He has taken the line share. I can smell space and so on. Eye on the idioms, guys. It's very important. So check them up on Google. I'm going to give you a link to check it up. Keep following and see you in the next lecture.